So the next topic we are going to discuss is associative curves. So inside that associative curves, we have project curve, intersection curve, select edges and as well as intersection point. So in order to explain these things, I have this model here opened and I'm going to show you how we can use the options. So now you can see in this model, I have created a simple plane here with some distance from this particular body so now suppose i am just going inside the sketch for on this plane and now let us go to project curve so project curve is a command which is going to project all the edges that are there available in the body say for example these edges suppose if you want along with these circles to be projected on this particular plane then you can use this project curve so go to project curve and select these lines whatever the lines you want to project and then you can click ok in this case it is going to project the curves at this point so now you can see as soon as you project the curves all these projected curves are associative with this particular body so that is why our sketch is fully defined so if you want to change anything in this curves you cannot able to do it because it is associative with this body so suppose if you want to project any curves and make a edit on that how you can do is you can just go to project curve and if you want this line to be projected and you can just switch off this associative and you can just click ok so now you can see whatever this projection curves are in blue color and this is in the gray color so it is nothing but this you can able to move it or edit it but this one you cannot able to do any changes so next we are going to move to intersection curves so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to take a plane here with some distance maybe till here okay So now the intersection curve is nothing but whatever the body that is going to intersect or body faces that are going to intersect with your sketch plane. So that will be extracted. Say for example, now you can see this is the sketch and we have a body here which is intersecting at this point. So this lines if you want to create a sketch in that case you can use the intersection curves. So we'll just go to sketcher environment here and I'm going to select this plane and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to intersection curves and in this intersection curve you can see the tangent faces are by default it is selected if you want a single face is the best option so you can select a single faces you can see once you select the face you can see the lines which are generated here so those lines are nothing but it is a intersection curves okay so these are the lines that will be extracted and these are called as intersection curves and in the intersection curves also we have a associative option so if you if you keep associative on then you cannot able to modify the curves so suppose if you want to modify those intersection curve then you just need to switch off this associative okay so now once you click ok you can see this is nothing but a intersection curves so the next topic we are going to talk about is silhouette edges so now let us move on to the next curve that is silhouette edges so this is going to create a shadow curves of any body faces say for example i'll just go to sketcher environment i'll just go to sketch on this plane and we'll just click ok and now suppose you can see here this is a cylindrical surface so if you want a cylinder edge suppose this edge if you want to create on this particular plane in that case even intersection curves is not going to work and as well as the project curves is not going to work so in this case you can use the silhouette edges so you can just go to here and select this silhouette curves and then you can just choose this cylinder so when you have a cylinder whatever the shadow of this particular cylinder will be projected on this particular plane so you can just click ok and you can see here this edge is also projected on this particular plane so this is the difference between the intersection projected curves and as well as silhouette curves 
So now we are going to talk about intersection point. So intersection point and intersection curves are, are almost same, but in intersection point, you are going to get a point. So I'll just go to sketcher environment. So you can see here in this plane, so whatever this edge, so is going to intersect at this point. So if you want that point to be created, so in that case, you can just go to intersection point and select this particular curve. So you are going to get a point at this location. You can see this is the point which is created is nothing but intersection point. So these are the different kinds of associative curves we can able to create in NX2506. 